Okay, folks, this here's Mike from Mike's Golf Shop, where we buy golf. That's right. We buy golf clubs. Now, folks, in this ever-changing world of constant digital evolution, we now have a uh, online uh, database cart thingy, my Bob, for you to sell us your clubs. Isn't that awesome? That's what we got. Now, just to give you an indication, this is Mike's Golf Shop, uh, dot com homepage. And uh, we're going to go through here and kind of show you how to use the new system. Uh, it is not completely 100% intuitive. It does have little kind of weird things on there that sometimes cause me a little consternation. But at the same time, it's functional and it's up and running. And so I wanted to do this little video so that you could see what it's all about. Now, you can just watch this video and uh, see how to do it. And of course, by any means, you can call me during the normal business hours four two three five five eight oh three seven two here at the shop monday through friday ten to six uh, eastern and uh, saturday ten to four sunday we're closed uh... and if you got a problem you, we can talk through it and of course once you get used to the using the system and it's no problem okay so but anyway to to move this thing forward so you can see what's going on you take your little uh, cursor here and you go up here and say sell your golf clubs see that little link there of course, we have one here too. It goes to the same place, but you go to sell your golf clubs, and that's going to take you to a page that um, there we go. Cool. It's going to take you to a page where it's going to kind of explain to you what is going on here, okay? Now, um, here at Mike's Golf Shop, of course, I'm Mike, and we are, I'm famous for buying golf clubs. Everybody knows that we buy golf clubs, right? So, uh, you go to this little page right here, and then you click this button here that says, Sell Your Golf Clubs. Okay, and when you do that, that's going to take you to another database-driven website, okay, that is, in fact going to show you um, various and sundry brands that we have available. There are some simple steps here. Basically, you're going to browse our database and find the clubs you want to sell. You're going to add them to the cart. Once you've entered all the clubs you want to sell, then that's when you're going to enter your customer information. You're going to click Review Order. Okay, and this is the order of clubs that you're going to sell to us. And you're going to place order, which is alerting us to the fact that you want to sell us the clubs. And then, you know, through the miracles of modern technology, you know, we get an uh, alert that says, hey, somebody wants to sell you clubs, that sort of thing. So I'm just going to walk you through that. By the way, there, if you go down here to the bottom of this little page, there are some FAQs here frequently asked questions as you know that uh, we'll keep adding to this list so that you can kind of you know answer your own questions or whatever of course you can always feel free to call us we'll answer your questions no problem but anyway that's going to kind of tell you what the gag is on this whole deal so if you go here then these are the brands of clubs that we're buying notice there's not too many brands at the moment our database of clubs on here is not too big at the moment we're starting with the most recent, newest thing first and working our way back on those uh, things because that's just kind of a no-brainer way to do this and build the Great Wall of China. So, just to get into it so you can kind of see what's up, let's say, for example, you have a Titleist driver that you want to sell to us, okay? So, you go to Titleist, you see there, and a bunch of clubs come up, right? 
Uh, and we have broken down into other categories as to what kind of club that it is. So in this case, you're selling me a driver, right? And uh, let's just say, for example, you want to sell me a C16, <laughs> okay? So you go to the C16 there, and you, you have to notice you have to rate the condition. So uh, we buy them based on condition and also a right or left hand or that sort of thing. So you go in here and you go, yeah, man, this thing is new. Yeah, I've never hit it. I want it as a tournament prize. I do not want this thing, whatever. New, of course, means new. Never hit with all peripherals. Very good means very good. You know, use maybe one season with all peripherals. Average is going to be average based on the age of the club. Below average, same thing. Below average based on the age of the club. Or poor, which is, okay, we reshafted it. You know, it's got sky marks, blah, blah, blah. Okay. We're going to leave it up to you to determine what that thing is because we do business friendship way here at Mike's Golf Shop. So, for example... I just won this C16 driver's a tournament prize. I don't want this thing. And uh, I have to select the dexterity right-handed or left-handed. Unfortunately, I hate to say it, lefties, but uh, your clubs are not worth as much as right-handed. It's just a supply and demand issue. So anyway, it's a new right-handed golf club. And so once I have determined this, yeah, this is exactly what I'm going to sell to Mike, then you have to add it to cart, okay? So once you click that button there, you add it to the cart. Here's the cart. You're looking at it. You'll notice a couple things about this. Number one, it shows you what we're paying for the club. That's the black number. Okay? And then you see this line down here that says, we pay you dollars equal to the red number in positive dollars. Now, the reason we do this this way is because this zeroes out the transaction from the standpoint of charging your credit card. So in fact, there will be no charge for you to place this order. And you'll notice also that what we're gonna send you is $260, okay? Not a minus $260. That's an accounting thing that goes on our accounting system and that shows a credit on your account. And when we receive the clubs, we flush that out and write you a check for $260 or send it to your PayPal account either way. But you're gonna get $260 for this club. That's what that little red thing means. I know it's kind of confusing, blah, blah, blah. But that's the deal, okay? Uh, now you'll see enter a promo code. Occasionally we might run a promo on something and we'll tell you more about that. Now, here in fact is where you, are, you will, will enter your billing information, okay? In my case, Um, company name's not necessary. There's my street address. Uh, okay, phone number. email address, right? Now you get down here to credit card information. Now, why in the world would I have to enter my credit card information on an order where I'm not going to pay anything? Well, this is for identification purposes to make sure that you're in fact a real person, okay? So, you got to enter all this stuff. So, I'm entering this credit card information here now. Of course, uh, one of my close associates here at the shop is, in fact, probably going to, going to block, block out that credit card number so that in fact everybody and their brother is not taking my credit card number and charging it up to the moon. But basically what I've just done is enter my credit card information. Now you can see down here you got a couple choices, uh, review, order, or continue shopping. Of course, 
you don't have to enter all your billing information uh, if you're going to continue shopping. You have to do that as the last step before you go to review order. Now, when you uh, click review order, what's going to come up here is kind of the last screen before you send us the list of clubs that you want to sell us. So right here, I want a C16 driver as a tournament prize. I don't want it. It's brand new. I'm going to send it to Mike. Give me some cash. I've entered all the information. There's my address, C-State zip phone, email address, and you can see payment summary today is $0. That means that nothing's going to be charged on your account today. And we are going to, in fact, pay you the uh, positive dollar amount of this red number here, $260 for this driver, okay? Now, then what you do is just place order, boom. Now, once you do that, of course, we receive notification of the fact that you have, in fact, sent us this order. Now, what's going to happen now is... Of course, you can hit finished or whatever, and you're done with the whole process there. Now, what's going to happen now is we are going to be in receipt of that order notification, meaning that we're going to find out very quickly that you, in fact, are going to want to sell us this club. Now, um, during regular, normal business hours, the response that you receive from us is going to be practically immediate. But after hours, since we are physically going to go in there and handle all of these transactions, um, then you are in fact going to receive notification uh, that we've got your order, et cetera, the next business day. So if it's after hours, uh, you're not going to receive anything until 10 a.m. Eastern the next business day. And of course, Sunday we're closed. So there, there are some chances where I might intercept that on the weekend and be able to come process it. I mean, we're a small company. So bottom line is, uh, what happens next is you are going to receive notification, hey, we got your list here of the clubs you want to sell us. And we're going to ask you, how do you want to receive your payment? Do you want to check or do you want PayPal? That's how we're going to do it for the first little while to make things simple. All right, that's going to be an email. You're going to have to respond to that email. Once you respond to that email and say, yeah, I want PayPal, here's the PayPal ID, or yeah, just send me, mail me a check to this address, whatever. Uh, either way, that's fine. And then what we are going to do is we're going to go into the USPS system and we're going to create a mailing label for you to slap on the box. So the very next thing that's going to happen is you're going to receive in your email inbox a USPS PDF label uh, that you can print out and slap on the box, prepaid shipping, to send your clubs to Mike's Golf Shop, okay? Then, once we receive the clubs, which will take, you know, two or three days, you can track that, of course. Uh, it's going to take a few days to get the clubs in here. As soon as we receive those clubs... Then we're going to just check them off your list and go, yep, he sent us all these clubs. And, you know, we'll already know, do you want PayPal, do you want check, whatever. And we're going to send you a check or we're going to send you the PayPal money at that moment. Okay? So it's a quick, simple, easy system that is uh, going to be fun to use. You can tell your friends. And by all means, feel free to use the system. We do business friendship way. If there's some kind of problem or error, call us. We'll work through all that, but the bottom line is we got we have now a database system here on our website where we can buy your golf clubs and we pay the highest possible dollar amount for them. So tell your friends, thank you so much. Look forward to doing business with you guys and uh, appreciate it. And come see us again very soon, and we hope you use the system and enjoy it. Thank you. See you later.